Hello, hello. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. How are you doing today? Hi, coach. Welcome, welcome. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, good evening, Edma. Hi, teacher. Hello, hello. Good evening, Norma. How are you? Hello, Laura. Good evening, welcome. Hello, Blanca. Hello, Yancy. Hello, Maria Elizabeth. Hello, Christina. Hello, George. Anna. Hello, Josia. Hello, Edwin. Hello, Susanna. How are you today? How was your day? My day was excited and but very well. Okay, what did you do today? And I studied and cleaning my house. And I visit the doctor because my children are sick. Oh, okay, all right. So it sounds like you had a very, very busy day. Yeah. All right. Okay. Well, welcome back, everybody. I hope that you all are doing great. I hope that everybody had an excellent day and that you are ready for your English class. Who can tell me what information do you remember about yesterday's class? What did we talk about? What do you recall? What do you remember about yesterday's class? Pronoun. Okay, pronunciation. Very good, Jocelyn. Uh, can you give me an example of the pronunciation exercises? Can somebody give me an example of the pronunciation exercises that we were practicing yesterday? One example. Often. How often? Okay, very good. How uh, long? How, how long, long do you spend at the school? Okay, how long do you spend at school? Very good. All right. All right, excellent job, guys. So yesterday we finished the first section. So I would like for us to move forward today. And we're going to be looking at the next section, which is did during the past weekend, weekend activities. We're going to be looking at section 2.2. Everybody listen, please. Listen, please. Hi to all. Welcome to section seven. Can everybody had a hear? Great time. In this session, participants yes, so. listen to a conversation. Can everybody hear? Okay. Yes. Okay. Yes. This conversation will walk us through activities that took place in the past. I really need you to concentrate as we'll begin to study simple past. As you listen to the conversation, write down all the verbs in the past you can identify. Did you do anything special? So, what did you do last weekend, Meg? Oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. That sounds like fun. Did you go to Lucky's? No, we didn't. We went to that new place downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I just stayed home and studied for today's Spanish test. Our Spanish test is today? I forgot all about that. Don't worry. You always get an A. All right. I would like for us to practice the pronunciation. Oh. Listen and repeat. So, what did you do last weekend, Meg? So, so what did you do last weekend, Meg? Meg? Oh, I had a great time. Oh, oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. 
That sounds like fun. That sounds like fun. Did you go to Lucky's? Did you go to Lucky's? No, we didn't. No, we no, didn't. No, we, didn't. We, didn't. we went to that new place downtown. We went, we went to the place downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? How about you? Did you go anywhere? Did you go anywhere? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. No, no, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I just I just stayed home and studied for today's Spanish test. Our Spanish test is today. Our, Our Spanish, Spanish test, test is today. 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 I forgot all about that. I, I forgot, forgot all about, about that. that. Don't worry. Don't, Don't, worry. Worry. Don't worry. worry. You always get an A. You, you always, always get an A. A. All right. Let me have two volunteers. Two. Me, teacher. Me, teacher. All right. Me. Nubia and Jose Luis. Yes. Nubia and Jose Luis. Nubia, you're going to be Meg. Yes. Jose Luis, you're going to be Rick. Uh, can you share the screenshot, please, teacher? Yes. Okay. Ready, action. So, what did you do last weekend, May? Oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke, karaoke uh, bar and town. With some. Sang. 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 With some. Friends on Saturday. That's soon like fun. Did you go to Lucky's? No. Wedding. Wedding. We went to that new place. Don't tell. How how about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere. Whole weekend. I just stay home. And I study for today Spanish test. Home. Or Spanish. Spanish test. Or Spanish test. It's today. I forgot all about that. Don't worry. You always get a, 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 an A. An A. An A. Okay. An A. Okay. Good. Good. Excellent. Good job, guys. Very good. Nubia, thank you, Jose. Uh, go ahead, Nubia, select somebody. And Jose, select somebody. Okay. Pico. Um, Alba Mendez. All right. Alba Mendez, you are going to be Rick. Okay. Uh, uh, let me see. Jorge? Jorge. Jorge. Jorge, can you hear me? Yes, teacher. I can hear you. All right. Jorge is Meg. Action. So what uh, did you do last weekend, Mel? I don't I don't was the the spring teacher. Oh, I see. I have uh, my mobile. Can you see it now? Yeah. All Thank right. you. Yes. Please repeat, Miss. Repeat, please. So, okay. So, what did you do last weekend, Mel? 
oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. That sounds like fun. Did you go to Lucky's? No, we didn't. We went to that new place downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere or weekend. I just studied home and study for today's Spanish test. Our Spanish test is today? I forgot all about that. Don't worry. You always can. You always can. And A. Excellent. You always yes. get an A. Repeat. You always, you always get an A. You always, always get an A. All right. Excellent. Excellent. Good job. Now, what I would like for you to do is Alba, select somebody. George, select somebody. Uh, Edma Asadia. Edma Asalia, you are going to be Rick. Blanca George. Guadalupe Benavides. Blanca Guadalupe, you are going to be Meg. Okay. okay. The picture. Yes. Action. So, what did you do last weekend, Meg? Oh, had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on some Saturday. Saturday. That sounds like fun. Did you go to Lucas? No, we didn't. We went to that new place down, downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I used to stay home and I said for today Spanish test. Our oh, Spanish test is today. I forgot all, all about that. Don't worry, you always get an A. Excellent, don't worry, you always get an A, very good. All right, at this moment, what I would like for us to do is I would like for us to work in pairs and I would like for everybody to practice the conversation in pairs. At this moment, do you have any questions about the vocabulary? Do you have a question about the meaning? or anything like that. Questions about the vocabulary or the meaning or something like that, pronunciation? No, coach. I Nobody? In my case, no. Okay, all right. So we're gonna work in pairs and I would like for you to practice the conversation and then we will come back to the class. You will have three minutes to practice the pronunciation. Three minutes to practice the pronunciation. Ready, let's go. I see Noemi, maybe you can practice with Emilio or Silvia or Yancy or Jose Enrique or Nelson.
Ya le veo. Mm. Mm. Ahorita. ¿La mandó? Sí, ahorita. Creo que me va a salir más fácil si la... Ay, no, no me sale. Otra vez. Y a mí no me agarra, no me carga. Tengo malísimo el internet. Bueno, entonces esperemos que me pueda verlo ahí. Si quiere, si usted la tiene, si quiere, empiece usted, porque es mentira. No me... mm, lo que pasa es que por eso que le toca también pronunciar. Pues sí, pero léalo usted, léalo usted una vez y después lo leo yo. Okay. Rick. So what did you do last weekend, Mel? And Mel is oh, I had a good time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. Rick, that song I found. Did you go to Lucas? Mel, no, we did didn't. We went to that new play. Don't tell me. How about you? Did you go anywhere? anywhere? Mm -hmm. No, I didn't. Go anywhere all weekend. I just studied home and studied for today's Spanish test. Mail. Our Spanish test is today. Oh, I forgot all about that. Don't worry. Your boy. Yeah. All right. Let me have two volunteers. Two volunteers. Let me have two volunteers. Two volunteers. Me, teacher, Jose, Luis. Okay, uh, Jose Luis, we're going to let somebody that has not participated. Uh, okay. Thank you, Jose Luis. Let me have one volunteer, please. Me, teacher. All right, Maria, you are going to be Rick. Okay. One more volunteer. One more volunteer. Me, teacher. All right, we're going to have Yancy. Yancy, go ahead, Yancy. You're going to be Meg. Action. Oh. What did you do last week, Mel? Oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. That sounds like fun. Did you go to Lucky? Did you go to Lucky? No, we didn't. We went to that new... I know what say. Downtown, how how about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I just started home and study for today's Spanish test. Our Spanish test is today. I forgot all about that. Don't worry. You always get, get an A. Excellent. Excellent. Very good. Very good. All right. Go ahead, Yancy. Select another partner. Jocelyn Bonilla. Okay. Jocelyn Bonilla. You are going to be Rick. And the other person, Maria, select somebody. Norma Elizabeth Callejas. Norma Elizabeth is going to be Meg. Action. 
No tengo la imagen del chat, teacher. Ok. De, 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 perdón, del párrafo. Ok. Can you see it right there? Inicio yo, ¿verdad? Yes. So, what did you do last weekend, May? Oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. That sounds like fun. Did you would did you go to movie? No, we didn't. We went to that new place downtown. How about you? Did you go to anywhere? Hey, I think Jocelyn got lost. Uh, Jocelyn, can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Tengo un poco mala la señal, teacher. Okay, that's okay. All right, we're going to stop right here. Now, for this activity, guys, what I want you to do is I want you to come down here to the discussion forum and you are going to write a similar conversation like this one over here. No tiene que ser así de largo, but you got to express activities on the weekend. El diálogo tiene que expresar cosas que hacen el fin de semana. You're going to write it right here. Any questions? Any questions? All right. El tema sería el del video. That is correct. Expresando cosas que hace usualmente el fin de semana. Eh, go to church. Go grocery shopping, clean your house, go to the car wash, etc. Ready? Let's go. Did I did eh, on visitar a mis I did I visited I visited I visited my family because you told in the very in pasado. Mm -hmm. I see. Si la oración es I did, I did. No, pero si es el did, no. el verbo tiene que ir en, en su base form. No, I did significa que... Let me see. Uh, did you ask me the question? Do you have a, a question for me? 
Mm. So what did you last weekend? Mm. Hola. Family. I uh, see. Sí. With my church. 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 Sí. Mm. Church. <laughs> Me la deletrea. <laughs> Okay, ahorita sería <coughs> Perdón, es C H U R. Okay. Es antes de la, ajá, short. Sure. Creo que así es. Short sure. with my family. My family, family, la I del final es Y. Uh, I went to your my with my family. Oh, Vaya, este, algo otro que de otra opinión de qué hacen su fin de semana. Okay. 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 Ahí al final de family, quizás hay que, hay que colocarle entonces en you. ¿El qué? En you. Es a a b n n d. I go. I, I go. I go. Mm -hmm. Oh. Hey. Mm -hmm. We. Mm -hmm. My. My. My family. No, no, no le escucho. No, para que lo ponga en, en el chat, porque de verdad no, no, no. Se le corta, no sé si a mí también. ¿Cómo dice? I go, I go out with my. La que está escribiendo. Hola. ¿Quién es la que está escribiendo ahorita? Compartió la pantalla para mandarle lo que iba. Yo. Blanca. Yes. Hola. Hola, estoy escribiéndole ahorita lo que. Uh -huh. Que le dé otro lo que. Uh -huh. Vaya. ¿Algo otro? Yo voy a poner este. Oh. Ay. Ay. Work. Ay, work. My house. Seguimos con Nenju. Podríamos ser después good. Y... 
my my family la is it me is going to to watch football together later repítame good Mm -hmm. my, my family and and me no no sé si se dice se escribe mi familia y y yo yo my sí my family and me are mm -hmm. going are going to watch watch football en ese caso sí sería yeah. my family And I go and uh -huh, and I go. And I go, uh huh. To watch football. Play soccer. Mm -hmm. To play soccer. Mm -hmm. Welcome back, welcome back. Is everybody finished? Is everybody finished? Yes, go. Oh, okay, all right. Now, what I would like for us to do right now is we're gonna take the attendance. So when I call your name, I would like for you to please say present. When I call your name, please say present. Okay, teacher. Alba Luz. Present. Present, okay. This is the third. Let me have Ana Yamilet. Present, teacher. Okay. Blanca Guadalupe. Present teacher. All right. Carlos Ernesto. Carlos Ernesto. Absent. Okay. Christina Claribel. Present teacher. All right. Edma Azalia. Present teacher. Okay. Edwin Alexander. Present teacher. All right. Efrain Emilio. Efrain Emilio. Absent. Okay. En el chat está escribiendo. Ah, okay. Let me see. All right, present, good. All right, the next one, Fatima Noemi. Fatima Noemi is absent. She writes, she writes in the chat this song. Oh, present, there she, she is. Present. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Herbert Eliseo. Herbert Eliseo. Absent. Isaura Evelia. Present teacher. Present. Good. Josia Alexiomar. Present teacher. Yeah. Right. The next one, George Alberto. Present teacher. Good. Let's see, Jose Enrique. All right, absent. Jose Enrique, absent. 
Jose Castro. Press him over right. here. Good, good. Maria Elizabeth. Maria Elizabeth. Present teacher. All right. Nelson Adan. Nelson Adan is absent. Norma Elizabeth Callejas. Teacher Nelson escribió en el chat de Zoom. Uh, that would be Nelson. Adan. All right, thank you. Norma Callejas. Present. Okay. Norma Lizano. Present teacher. All right. Nubia Christina. Present, okay. Oscar Alexander. Present teacher. Okay. Sylvia Lisette. Present. All right. Susanna Isabel. Susanna Isabel. Present. All right. Present teacher. Thank you. Yancy Melanie. Present. All right. Jenny, Carolina. Jenny. Present teacher. Okay. Present. Thank you. Jocelyn, Yvette. Jocelyn, Yvette. Present teacher. Okay. Perfect. All right. So we Present. have apps. Thank you. So we have absent Jose Enrique Orellana, Jonathan Josue, Herbert Eliseo, Efrain Emilio is present. Efrain Emilio was writing in the group, right? Emilio Acevedo, yeah, he's right there, okay. Carlos Ernesto is absent, and that's it. Okay, uh, at this moment, did everybody finish the conversation? Teacher. Hey, Fatima. Teacher. I'm sorry, never mentioned no. Fatima Marroquín. <laughs> ah, okay, let me check, let me check. Fatima Marroquin is present. Yes, you are present. Yes, thank you. I got it. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Did everybody finish the conversation? Todos terminaron el diálogo? Or do you need more time? Yes, teacher, I finished. Jose Luis, who is your partner? Uh, yes, with, uh, I don't know, no me acuerdo los nombres de quién estaba. ¿Quién estaba con José Luis? I'm teacher. Okay, Jocelyn y José Luis. Ajá. Action. Pero se lo voy a pasar a él. Okay, okay. okay. ¿A quién el chat? Okay. Ahí está ya Jocelyn. Eh, sí, yo sé, no sé si era ahí. Action, Jocelyn, José Luis. Okay, hello, did you, you finish the homework? Yeah, very easy classmate. I hope you read from my teacher and you. Yes, me too. You will take course free? Yeah, I will like. Okay, that's right. Bye. 
Bye. Excellent. Good job. Ding, ding, ding. All right. Anybody else finished the conversation? Alguien más que haya terminado la conversación? Que quiere compartir? Excellent, Jocelyn. Excellent, Jose. All right. If you are not finished, is your homework. If you are not finished, that is going to be your homework. Right now, we are going to move forward and we're going to be looking at will also be taught for the simple past. Listen, please. and regular verbs will also be taught. Welcome back. So now it's time to study past tense. For us to succeed learning it, we need to learn verbs in simple past. We'll teach you how to make questions and how to answer in both affirmative and negative form. Please pay attention. Simple past. Did you work on Saturday? Yes, I did. I worked all day. No, I didn't. I didn't work at all. Did you go anywhere last weekend? Yes, I did. I went to the movies. No, I didn't. I didn't go anywhere. What did Rick do on Saturday? He stayed home and studied for a test. How did Meg spend her weekend? She went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends. Let's talk about questions in simple past. Did you realize the auxiliary we used? Did. We use auxiliary did for questions and short answers, positive and negative. Did you realize what happened to the question after we used did? See the next example. Did you go to the beach? Did he break the window? In each question, the verb is used in simple present because we use did. It is not correct to say, did you went to the beach? Did he broke the window? So remember, every time you ask a question in simple past, you need to use the auxiliary did and the main verb goes back to present. For short answers in affirmative and negative in simple past, we must use did within the answer as we saw on the chart. Yes, I did. No, I didn't. This takes us to say that we use verbs in simple past when we say affirmative sentences. Take a look at the following statements. They went to the park last weekend. I woke up late this morning. She came late to class. I suggest for you to study and learn verbs in simple past for you to express past activities and experiences. All right, guys, now for this activity, what are, I'm going to do is I'm going to give Let's you some examples. I'm going to give you some more examples. For example, if I say to you, uh, did, did you go to the movies last weekend. What is the meaning? Did you go to the movies last weekend? What is the meaning? Fuiste a ver una una película el fin de semana pasado. Correct. Correct. Fuiste al cine el fin de semana pasado. ¿Cómo se responde esta pregunta? Yes, yes I, I did. did. Yes, I did. Yes. yes I did. Oh, no, I didn't. No, I, I did didn't. or no. no. I didn't. Okay. Or you yes, can I say, did. did you go to the beach? Last, that is correct. Last weekend. How do you respond to that question? 
No, I didn't. No, I didn't. All right. You could say, yes, I did. Or you could say, no, I didn't. Good. Another question. Give me an example. Somebody. Did you cook the chicken? All right. Did you eat chicken last night? Mr. Spoyo Anoche? Yes, I did. Yes. Yes, I did. I did. Or? No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Okay. Any questions about using did? Questions about using did. Okay. Now we're going to look at questions using what. Questions using what. Teacher, right. a question. Right. Yes. Um, en explicación entendí de que cuando se, se usa el did, el verbo va en presente. Correct. No, ahí no sufre modificación. Si se usa el lead, es correcto eso. No? Sí, sí, el verbo se queda en simple presente. Entonces, solo cuando va, pero yo quiero ver. Pero había otra hora, hay una oración ahí que, um, eh, por ejemplo, esta de What do you reach to on Saturday? Uh -huh. Si está ahí, está convertido. Ah, pero no lleva el lead, vea. La respuesta. Ajá. No, la respuesta está, el, el en la pasado. respuesta como no es pregunta, no necesita el auxiliar did. El verbo allí sí ya va en pasado. Por ejemplo, si yo le pregunto, eh, ¿qué cenó anoche? What, what did you eat last night? Allí sí, porque es pregunta. En respuesta sería, yo comí, I ate pupusas. Allí el verbo sí ya va en pasado. Eh, o, oh, oh. uh -huh. Este, más que todo, entonces el auxiliar va en preguntas nada más. Correct. Okay. That is correct. Eh, por ejemplo, si usted dice, eh, what did you study yesterday? ¿Qué estudió ayer? ¿Cómo va a responder? I studied. Studied, el verbo en pasado, English. Okay. O digamos, quiere de preguntar, ¿qué vio ayer? What did you watch yesterday? Y usted dice, yo vi una serie en Netflix. I watched a series on Netflix. Another question? No. Okay. Not no. Okay, ahora vamos a ver el how. How? Okay. Si usted pregunta, por ejemplo, how did you pay for that jacket? Right. ¿Cómo pagaste por esa chaqueta? I paid cash. Yo pagué en efectivo. Ok. O, oh, how did you cook the chicken? ¿Cómo cocinaste el pollo? Y tú dices, lo horneé. I baked it. Okay. 
o oh, cómo aprendiste ese inglés. How did you learn English? Y usted dice, yo estudié. I studied. Do you understand? Does anybody have a question? O sea, teacher, de que solo cambia el verbo cuando respondemos. That is correct. That is correct. Solo cuando responde. Okay. Teacher. Hi. Yo entiendo, lo que pasa es que aquí en el, en el caso de la pregunta, el auxiliar do es que ya está en pasado, es did. Uh -huh. Por lo tanto, en la pregunta, uh, si ya vemos que es did, sabemos que la respuesta va a ser en, en pasado simple, el verbo de la respuesta. Correcto, en el pasado. Así es. Sí. Ok. All right, guys, I want you to give me three examples. Quiero que me escriban tres ejemplos utilizando did, tres ejemplos utilizando what, y tres ejemplos utilizando how. Y lo van a escribir aquí, abajo, en el discussion forum. You will have three minutes to work with your partner. Va a tener tres minutos para trabajar con sus compañeros. And then we're going to check together. Let's go. A game, a, a practice, yes. activity. Did you, did you play? I will. Mama, I think I'll be a little Hola. 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 Dos ejemplos por cada una, ¿verdad? Yes. Santo, Dios, Cuat, y Hope, parece. La primera podría ser, did you, did you go, did you go to swim? Swim. Did you go to swim uh, a weekend? Ahí. A weekend? Podría ser la otra, did you, did you, eh, eh, Mexican food, eh, hey, hey. yesterday. Yesterday. Did, <clears throat> did you study so ayer, much? Ya, ayer tendríamos las dos de las dos de did. Son tres. Tres. Era sí. tres. Ah, ok. Sí. Podría ser did did you did you study study? Did you study some a lot? 
last last weekend. Last week. You study a lot last weekend. Okay. Okay. Ahora con los de what's what's did what's did. Podría ser what what I did. You go to be what what yesterday. What, what time? What time uh -huh. did you go to the, the yesterday? Como a general la pregunta, ¿a qué hora te fuiste a la cama ayer? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yes. What's what's wake up? No, pero Había faltado más con what, perdón. Voy a estar alguna más. Um, what did you what? All right. Let me have one volunteer, please. One volunteer, please, with the questions. Write the questions. Nobody wrote the questions? Hi, teacher. Hi, Jansi. Did you write the questions? Did you play tennis? Yes, I played tennis yesterday. Mm -hmm. What did her cook the breakfast? Mm -hmm. I cook eggs and beans for breakfast. Okay. Did you go to the concert? Mm -hmm. Yes, I did. No, I didn't. All right. Perfect, perfect. Thank you, Yancy. Let me have another participant. Another participant that wrote the questions. Nobody? Nosotros no nos terminamos. Hicimos tres. Did you press the what D? Continue. Um, sería, pero no sé con quién. Uh, uh, did you cut uh, fish yesterday? Mm -hmm. um, did you eat uh, Mexican food yesterday? Did you study some a lot last weekend? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Y luego, what the what the time? I oh, know what did you eat today? Y what did you did you do today? Very good, very good. What did you do today? All right, guys, let's continue working on the platform, and we will see you back on Monday. Good night. See Good you night. Monday. Bye. 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 Good night. Bye. See you Monday. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.